attitude to the game, stay mm -hmm. humble, stay passionate, stay hardworking, keep the drive. Just remember the hunger that you started with and never forget the hunger no matter where you are. Humbleness is the key. Keep driving and you don't know. Hey man, so your boyfriend Jamil here. And yes, yes, I'm back with my video. And as you look at tell by the title of the video, I'm back with another episode of Trim Cut Tuesdays. Obviously, I know you lot are thinking, raw, wow, he ain't done an episode for almost two years, but you know what it is? Man, I saw the cool on TikTok, innit? I saw the violation, I thought, you know what? If I'm going to come back, I was going to come back big. I'm going to come back better. Do you get know what I'm saying? So obviously today, as you look and see by the title of the video, we're going to be going to HD Cut. He's cut enough, man. Footballers, enough YouTubers. And obviously, I'm trying to just come back. Obviously, if you've been watching from before, I used to get level one skin fade, but that's all changed now. Do you get know what I'm saying? Man's on the taper thing. So we're gonna go there. Obviously, right now I'm looking like Santa the Conjuring, but it's kind of oh. <laughs> it's a man. But if you do like this video, make sure you like, comment, and most importantly, subscribe. Listen, aye, aye. Do you say if I step on a beat like this, they know that I'm taking a piss? Me and Broski coming in twos like a chocolate, chocolate thing. I ain't talking about Twix. Mm. I snuck it to Wireless, I snuck it to Wembley. I'm taking that risk. Mm. I worked at next, I worked at Sainz, I've done them shifts. Uh, we done them shifts. Ah. We done them tricks. Ah. S O O. Get it quick. Bah. Hello, hoes. Ah. Too many gal. Too many. Can't say the names right now because I might get. Oh. If I say the names, names, you say I might get blackboard, blackboard. I don't even know what to run with that, but I might like gamble. <laughs> Too many trips this year. Yeah. Plymouth, Cardiff, <laughs> SO. Ah, 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 I've been Liverpool, mm. Manny, ah, Cardiff, ah, all of the ah, Addison. Yo, <laughs> hey. Broskis do not tour. tour. Yeah, he's far from poor. poor. Peas in the petty, peas in the petty. Yeah, he's trying to go to the shore. Sure. Listen, he went to uni and studied law. <laughs> <laughs> oh. He used to have to the court. <laughs> I went to uni and I studied law. So upon arriving to the shop, straight away I'm gobsmacked because posted up on the walls, there's just bare sign football shirts. I'm seeing Messi, I'm seeing Cristiano Ronaldo, I'm seeing Sterling, I'm seeing Foden, I'm seeing Pogba. I could go on for days. As me and Tuba sit down, Sheldon HC comes up to us and asks us if we want to play FIFA on the P5. And me and Bats were like, raw like that. Like, yeah, like, yeah, like, why not? Do you get what I'm saying? Like, look at the service. Huh? Obviously, I ain't played FIFA in a while, so the scoreline can't be revealed too tough. But yeah, love, love. Coming into the seat now, he asked me exactly what I want. And I tell him I want a tape of fade. He asked me if I want the top sponge, and I'm like, yeah. So obviously, at this point, it seems like we're on the same page with the vision of the trim. Again, if you've been following the series from the beginning, would have known that if a barber backs up the black gloves, you know he's getting worksy. <laughs> you know the trim's about to be a 7 out of 10 minimum. As the trim begins, I realise he goes straight towards the fade region of my head. By doing this, it kind of creates the transition from early. So when he shapes up, it's clearer to see. Soon after that, he begins to gently cut around my head to perhaps get rid of any like loose or split hairs. And also, it just gives it a good shape. He now proceeds to go towards the hairline. And as you lot know already, we've had a lot of previous issues with the hairline. Wow. I really swung my thing back, but you know, we're, we're here, we're breathing. Ooh. Obviously, today that wasn't going to be the case, because as my brother T-Bite says here, Sharp. that's exactly how my thing's set. To further define the shape up, he proceeds to add the black spray as well as blow drying it, so that it stays on the hairline. As he shapes on my beard area, I just think, raw like, when I was 19 when I started Trim Cut Tuesdays with hardly any facial hair you get. And now man's 21, I basically got a beard, like it's crazy still. But obviously here he applies a gel on my hair so that it will look good after he sponges it. <laughs> As you can see, he's not using a normal sponge. It come like a glove, which I feel sponges the hair better as he would get like a better feel of like my scalp and that. To end of the trim, he blow dries my hair and he brushes me down. Yeah, yeah, obviously, as you can see, I'm done with the trim, innit? But before I get into the analysis and that, I'm just going to show you a lot and talk to the man himself. 
HD. Hey, what up, bro? What up? What up? <laughs> Obviously, I know who you are, and a lot of people know who you are, but for those who don't, like, tell them about yourself. Man, you right, right now you're standing right in HD Cutsman with a group of lovely, significant barbers that are doing great things out there. Okay. We, myself, Mr. HD, along with the team, we take care of lots of celebrity high profile clients all over Europe. Okay. You came here today, you experienced the HD Cuts, you know what time it is, you know what we do. It's what we represent. I like that. So obviously we spoke a little bit on the sea and that, but they didn't hear that. So what like drives you to obviously cut hair for, as you said, global superstars, local people, etc., etc. Man, you know what? What drives me is man just to change. Man, I like to change a person's yeah. image, the way they look, how they feel, how they represent themselves, yeah. and that's what makes me feel good, man. That's yeah. definitely I'm just an like, image changer, man, that. and that's what I represent the age. Yeah. Evident, cause like, man, I see the shopping, I see like the the football shirts, I see the cleanliness of the shops, so I see you take pride in obviously what you do and that. Which is good to see, but do you have any like advice for like upcoming barbers? Anyone that's you know I mean trying to become a barber? Advice to young barbers, mm. stay true to the game, stay mm. humble, stay passionate, stay hardworking, keep the drive. Just remember the hunger that you started with and never forget the hunger no matter where you are. Yeah. Humbleness is the key. Keep driving and you don't know. That's You're powerful gonna be words, man. Powerful. And this is my friend right here. Well, well, thank you for that, man. Yeah. Appreciate the come, man. Yeah. God bless you, yeah. brother. Yeah. 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 As you look to see, we're done with the trim, and if I must say this trim here. Fiery, you know what I'm saying? HD for real. Obviously, upon arriving to the shop, it was clear to see that this guy, he's been about. I'm seeing sand shirts, I'm seeing folding, I'm seeing Pele, I'm seeing Sterling. And I was like, raw, like, you know what I mean? This is this is pretty good. This is pretty different. But what really stood out to me was when we was waiting, a man was telling me, raw, do you not want to play P5? I looked at Mike, so I was like, Mike, so you hearing this? <laughs> Obviously, play a little match, you know what I mean? It, it went a bit left, but... Oh! It is what it is. I ain't played FIFA for time. But obviously onto the trim. I've sat in the seat now and I've told HD, I've told him raw like listen, man's trying to get the Jude Bellingham taper fade. He's like, yeah, yeah, I got you, I got you. Obviously, if you've been watching the series before, man used to get skin fade level one, but it's different now. Do you know what I mean? So the transitions are much different, it's much lower as you can see. Do you know what I'm saying? But on the whole, you know what I mean, did the bit area right, just the way I wanted it. Mustache, just the way I wanted it. So I have to, I have to give the trim a 10-10. Do you know what I mean? Like, it's probably the best trim on Trim Cut Tuesdays history and I'll definitely recommend you lot to go to this barber 100% if you've got, you got a bed in it. Obviously if you do like this video make sure you like, comment, subscribe. If you want to see more Trim Cut Tuesday episodes comment down below where I should go. I might bring it back. Do you know what I mean? But yeah peace peace.